Hey, what's going on, y'all? RJ here with CV Tech, and today I am doing an unboxing of the ZTE Z52. Uh, of course, being a big ZTE fan like I am, I had to buy a ZTE phone to try out on the network. Now, this is a low-end budget device. Um, as you see the specs down here, you got a 5-inch touchscreen display, 6.0 Marshmallow, 8 gigabytes of ROM, a 5 megapixel rear camera with 2 megapixel front facing camera. This does work on the Verizon network as well. Open the flap here, you'll see the phone. And you'll see some of the other specs down here as well uh, 4g lte uh, 18 hours battery talk time 20 day standby time 8 gigabytes of internal storage a 1.4 gigahertz quad core processor bluetooth 4.2 and stuff like that so let's go ahead here and we'll get this thing unboxed Right here we go. We'll go ahead and pull the phone out and set that to the side, and we'll see what comes in the box. Now we got the battery here, got the uh, back cover right there, of course, and we got some uh, phone and feature guide here. We have your straight talk terms and conditions, and it looks like that we have the micro USB charging cable. As, as well as the wall adapter, but we'll leave all of that in there. We don't really need all that kind of stuff right now, so let's just go ahead and leave out the back cover and the battery, and we'll set this to the side. Okay, so we got the phone right here. Let's go ahead and pull out the back cover out of this little packet here, just like this. And now we'll remove the battery. Now, I'm not really sure if I hold the battery milliamp hour or not or if I even know myself but we'll find that out right now uh, in this video of course it looks like this has a 28 a 2800 milliamp hour battery I'm sorry for the light and I'm trying a few things new with the lighting around here <laughs> and when I bring it in close it gets kind of dark so I do apologize for that uh, but it is a 2800 milliamp hour battery uh, so let's go ahead and look at the back of it here now right here of course is your uh, sim card slot micro sd card slot right there let's go ahead and throw the battery in here and we'll throw on the back cover pull out the front okay so looking at the back here we see you have your five megapixel rear camera your flash, your uh, straight top logo here, your single rear speaker down there at the bottom. On the front, you do have your receiver and front facing camera, your back home and recent button down there. On the left side, you got your volume rocker. On the top, you got your 3.5 millimeter headset jack and secondary mic. And on the right is your power button. Let's go ahead and give it its first boot up. So we got ZTE there, powered by Android, and you know I know this is a you know a, a cheaper device. You know the Z52 is you know one of those phones. It's got a pretty good processor, been the 1.4 uh, quad core, but with the one gigabyte of RAM and the eight gigabytes of ROM, I'm a little iffy on how it's going to perform. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get this all set up, and I'll come right back. Okay, so we're all set up here now and ready to go. Now, my light that I was using earlier did not work out. It was causing it to just, I don't know, act weird on my lightning here. So I'm going to have to try a different way to get better lighting going on in here. But anyway, it's all good for now. Now, you can tell right away, this phone does not have a 720p display. It's like a FWBGA 480 display. Uh, but so far, right now, the phone does feel smooth. You know, of course, there's really nothing uh, on the phone, you know, as far as bloatware, really, right now. I mean, Wi-Fi utility, my account downloader, uh, has Messenger and Facebook already pre-installed, and uh, 1W Weather App Finder. But other than that, there's really not a whole lot, you know, on this device uh, that I see. Um, now, looking down here at the settings and, and the storage, 
we've already used 5.23 gigabytes out of 8. That means we only have 2.77 gigabytes available. Available out of 8. And I'm not even sure if this phone uses a deductible storage or can we have an SD card? I have no idea. This phone also is running on Android 6.0.1, so not even the latest version of Android here. As you see, the little, marsh, the little marshmallow dude there. Yeah, so I will be downloading a few apps. I can't download many, seeing as it's only got, you know, very little internal storage. But I will try out the processor, see how it does run on apps and that I use every day and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah. Um, just my first look here and unboxing of the ZTE Z5 II. I will be checking on the, the adaptable storage, the uh, apps to SD, and the cameras, and I'll be just checking everything out and seeing how it works uh, in general. So, if this was helpful and informative in any way, hit that like button. If you got any questions or comments, leave it down below, and I'll get back with you as soon as possible. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. I really appreciate it. Y'all have a good one, and we'll see y'all in the next video.